This is a of us, corporate, corporate jet for airport jet, you know, rock out of jets. But he designed the rear sexy, you know. Anyway, his car was the rear car, it was a steam car, a steam power car. You know a lot of steam engine works, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. This was the rear, the rear steam car. Government, oh, the boiler explode. Fuck the government. Really, fuck the government. <laughs> fuck them. They're all a bunch of politicians go, oh, they're all greedy politicians. We can have steam cars right now. But now we gotta depend on oil. Oh, that was Lear's last project before he died, the Lear's steam car. Then he died. Way to be Lear. Hey, be honest. Radio. The Rolling Stones again. But it's all right now. Matter of fact, it's a gas. I'm doing one more story, one more story. At my brother's bar in Glendale, I met Pamela the Wagner Jammer. She's a redhead. <laughs> both of them, both of them were pirates of World War II, San Diego. <laughs> but they call her Pamela the Wagner Jammer. Because she used to smoke pot and dry at the same time. <laughs> she was called Pamela the Wagner Jammer. <laughs> one time, Pam's driving me around in her one of the cars, listening to the radio. She made a left turn and somebody whacked her. But I saved her mug from going through the windshield. After the crash, said, Jerry, thanks for saving my face. She's going to divorce with her Cuban husband. Well, they reconcile, I imagine. Anyway, like I said, I don't go over with married women. But she's the process of getting a divorce from her Cuban husband. But I guess they made up. I don't know. Pammer the Whammer Jammer. She says, Jerry, thanks for saving my face. You're welcome, Pam. Smoking the dope. Not a good idea to smoke dope when you drive. But she didn't listen. I hate dope. I said, don't smoke around me. I met a girl, I've been blood ups recently. She had a medical for a medical medical work. I said, Jerry, my motor home burned down, I was able to save my cat. That's her story. I said, you're from Chicago, aren't you? I said, how did you know that? Because you haven't lost your Chicago potato tomato accent. My mom was from Chicago. I have an Indiana, I don't have an Indiana, but she had an accent. I can tell you, you've been in California five years, but you've never lost your ass to shoot the Irish shoot forever. Oh boy. They were spectacular, too. <laughs> they were spectacular. After when she got in the shower, she looked at me like a, I, We didn't have sex, though. No sex. She's just, she's just a day tripper. You know, a big teaser. But she loved me like the difference. And they were spectacular. <laughs> but that's about the whole subject. That's said, give me a back rub. My back hurts. So she gave me a back rub while she was. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I said, give up, it was fine, I'm 15, give me a back rub. Huh, I, I don't need that Viagra though, for real. I need a girlfriend. <laughs> I'm in love with this waitress, but she's married, she's a cat, but good boy. Let me start. She said, no, these dudes. She said, what dude? Just took a fucking boot stick up my ass. <laughs> I said, I'm doing it. I said, she said, these dudes. She's read my dudes. <laughs> All right, here's let it be. It's too hot in here, man, I gotta take off my jacket. To the plants that they will see. Let's look at these pictures. Here's the old stage show. Look at this. Let it be. Let it be. Let it be. Pacific Creamery. That's your dairy cream. That's your dairy. See, see that Pacific dairy cream? That's your dairy driver. It's so warm in here. I'm used to the call up from South Bend, Indiana, 1217 Congress. They were into Michigan. They were into the crazy state of California, 66. I get down here, it's winter time. All these kids are bundled up and said, Where's your jacket? I said, What jacket? It's 50 degrees outside. I just come from Michigan. And then I say, Jerry, here's a corn row. This is how you plant seeds. They put it in acres. I said, What is this? Retard school? <laughs> we used to plant wild strawberries and everything. Uh, I'm traveling from the country, you know. So what is this agricultural retard school? This is how you plant seeds, Jerry. I said, okay, I think that's fine. <laughs> I said, I was at Bill Bell Junior High, Bill Bell Northridge. My favorite guy there was Olson. His dad was a real estate man, Mr. Olson. We used to make jokes on the bottom of the hill and say, listen to this one, Jerry. 
Hocus pocus, you're a tocus, it's your lucky day. He you do Yiddish. So it's a hocus pocus, you're a focus, you can't you say, hocus pocus, you're a tocus. I mean the butthole, a tocus. Hocus pocus, you're a tocus. But he's hocus pocus, you're a tocus. Ask me tocus, here you're ask me tocus. The song Ask me tocus about smoking marijuana. But then there's one famous song, Cal Arts. This is my departure song, Cal Arts. The Disney School in Valencia. My dad had a gas station at Alliance and I-5 when he retired from IBM for his brain tumor. So they built this school called Cal Arts. Walt Disney built it, right? This is a Valencia golf course. So I'm in the summertime. I'm down at my dad's station right at Katie Noel, my college sweetheart. I'm saying, yeah, I'm going to be up. I'll be up to Reno pretty soon. She lived in Reno. She did a divorce with Steiner as a nuclear submarine guy. Navy wife spreads these rumors. Oh, you know what they do in the port? They fuck around in the port. Anyway, she got divorced from him. She, she just wanted to marry me. Then my dad died of a brain tumor. Bummer. That was a bummer. That was a bummer. My dad fixed you up with Dino. My dad fixed you up with Dino. I'm going to say, I'm going I've been for 25 years. Took an early time, bought shots in the first place. John, man, John was my little brother who was in the shot school. So, my dad, man, he was John Box, been all funny because he never sacrificed the horse to me. So, my mom and dad made it happen. And, uh, little John has had a bigger sentiment than this. Then he had, he had a little secret plan of his own. It's the only little Irish plan. You did John, yeah. Ah, see, you know, it's me, you know, it's Jerry. He said, Jerry, I'm broken. I need money. I need money, Jerry. Anyway, I love all this money. I found out about his little secret plan, his little pension plan. Ah, John, you didn't even tell your brother about your little pension. I take an early retirement. Very mom, okay. With all that money you owe, now we're on equal terms with me, John. I found out I got him a Christmas present. It's uh, a hoodie from uh, Levi's. It's cold. He's up in Redwood City. It's cold up there. I got my hoodie. Levi's. I was going to get a light up P-Man shirt at the theater. No, it's too bright for John. I'll give a hoodie. He's coming out in 20. He's 18, two days. I told my sister Penny, you get to watch the Bible on Wednesday because John's coming out. The Lord's stone again. There's still a group of Lord's stone. Keith Richards, do you imagine that? A seven year old man going like this. <laughs> it's like Paul, you ever see a hard day's night? It's like Paul's grandfather. Paul's grandfather. He's a dirty old man. Paul's grandfather. He likes to gamble. Back around. Back around. He likes to gamble. I love, I love Las Vegas. I got too much to get. Even you can see him. I, I, I like Las Vegas. I like Vegas. I like Circuit Circus. I want some thousand bucks of Circuit Circus. But some some with a single bet. They got on a tape. Cheat me. She cheated me. A thousand bucks, I went like the ten minutes. I have about a thousand bucks to lose, that's all right. I still have fun. I have fun in Vegas. I got home for my 30th birthday. I was surprised by me. Julie spilled the beads. <laughs> and I was surprised, you know, Julie, I spilled the beads. <laughs> I got so drunk, I woke up by the toilet. They gave me a shot, shot, and shot. I woke up drunk by the toilet. <laughs> oh, God. I woke up drunk up by the toilet. My third and fourth part, so my part, we gave a shot up, shot up, something, whatever they're drinking, tequila, some kind of tequila. Have a little shot, Jerry, it's your birthday, okay, one more, one more. Third and fourth part, I got something I woke up by the toilet. My <laughs> five years sobriety, I'm separated, five years. Like I just told you, Clark, it's hard to do. Can we go to the boy and just go? The theater, down, we see movies down in the theater on Valley View. <laughs> the boy, I mean, that's, that's the lady in the summertime, you know. My mom was dying. I go visit my mom, then go visit Clark. I want to give you a bus or a car, you know. And then so I visit Clark, I go visit my mom. My mom's okay, she's doing better. John kept trying to John would not sign the DNR. Finally, he let go of mommy. So I can't think of this anymore, John. You get your ass down here now. Mom's dying. She 
probably forgot you were held her hand for 14 hours when she died. Which was, I appreciate my little brother for doing that. I didn't want you to go through nine months of suffering. I couldn't take it no more. I said, Dad, I couldn't take it no more. I can't watch mom suffer. You get your ass down here right now. Your mom's going to die. He's right there. Okay, I believe you, Jay. He threw down here and held her hand. And John asked me, why was I born, Jack? To Jerry. That was my mom's last kid to tell you the truth John. John, you're here to make the best of it. He said, why was I ever born, Jerry? He said, John, you're here to make the best of it. John was just looking for my mom's hand and she died. My mom's a Christian, but she was afraid to die. She had twin sister, Sylvia. Sylvia died four years ahead of my mom. She uh, told Sylvia died. She said, Levy's up next year. She said, God will decide what you died on. She lived four years younger. Sylvia was the dominant twin. It was a close one. I bet he died. <laughs> so, by no reason would Katie Noel. So, how we met. So, where's the candy bar? I was leaving Bingo. So, where'd you buy the Thunder Rush? I see him. Bought a bottle of wine. Went upstairs to a room. I made love. Fell in love with her. She had a pretty seat, but lost her. She had a pill. She had that baby. I would have married right now. Our first girl was going to be called Christina. The child of Christina. <laughs> then my dad died. So if I blew up, I didn't go back to work. Because the kids spent every, every day playing with her. Sold the land camera. Sold the park. Well, we leased it to Uncle Morris. Uncle Morris on the farm. He stayed here in World War II, but he had a dip club fight with my dad. That's why he was never in our family. He was living on us. For that drip up right now. Unfortunate accident for my dad. So I want to be the pot. I was in the pot flying over my dad's shell station. My dad, he had, a, he had to be a radar down here, so that's why he went to IBM after the war. It's funny how things happen that way, though. <clears throat> they were for a purpose. It's a job from here for the festival. Why well, was I born, Jerry? He had blonde hair. Yeah. All those kids have dark hair. It's not a blonde hair. I called him with blue eyes. My mom had blue eyes. I called him with blue eyes. But John got the ball to Now he's bald. I still got my hair. I just got my hair down to my shoulders. I wasn't a hippie, though. I was a worker. I had done my shoulders. There was no hippies. I said, to me, I don't got to Right now in the city of New Orleans, Penny Point, ain't no one to it. It's how you call it, don't go to it, it's a dog. You hear my first song. She loves you, yeah, yeah, yeah. She loves you, yeah, 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 yeah. You lost your love. Oh, yes, today I got the bagel from my mom. She's thinking of. And the only one to say it, she said she loves you, and you know that can't be bad. John plays bass, my brother mm -hmm. plays bass. Neil was on drums. He's like, I can't hear I know it's like Paul. It's so, she almost lost her mind, but now she said she knows. You're not the hurt kind, because she loves you. And you know that can't be bad. Yes, she loves you, and you know you should be glad. She loves you, yeah, yeah, yeah. She loves you, yeah, yeah, yeah. With a love like that, you know you should be glad. It's up to you. I think it's all you can. So I have to do apologize to her because she loves you and you know that can't be bad. She loves you and you know you should be glad. Stop for uh, Little Richard. It's high enough. Woo -hoo. With a love like that, you know you should be glad. I like bass, John plays bass, my brother plays bass guitar. <coughs> oh, 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 oh. With a love like that, you know you should be glad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 